Hello, this is Loredana and today I'll show you a preview of the type i a Rust attribute-like macro that allows you to export your Rust crate interfaces. This is how you would use the type i on your public or external functions. In the current in-work version, the interface contains the name of the function, the types and the labels of the inputs and outputs. I have created a Rust library here with WASM support. And here I have a Rust executable where I use the library and print its interface. So let's run it. This is how the interface description looks like. And we can also build our library with WASM pack and use it in JavaScript. And now we will actually have access to the proper interface types. Instead of being presented with a general type like number, and we can have more precise typing rules and build programmatic UIs like this one. The sum function takes values in the 32 integer range. So let's try it out. And now we know why we get an overflow here. This sum function takes values in the 16 integer range. And now we can actually differentiate them and do proper type checking. Stay tuned for the DType I macro release and future demos about other interesting use cases. Thank you for watching, check out our other videos and subscribe for more updates.